Hey friends, uh, I'm out here in the garage today. I want to tell you about the latest upgrade that I did on Angry Alice. I did it a couple week weekends ago, but uh, first chance I've had here to make a little quick video. So the uh, upgrade that I did was the uh, Clockworks and Kicker Audio stereo upgrade for my uh, Road Glide Special Angry Alice. All right, so in the box you get the uh, Kicker speakers. That is the uh, PSC 65. They are uh, coaxial speakers and it comes with a speaker grill. Uh, I did not use the speaker grill for my setup. Also in the box, you get the amp. The amp is the PXA 200.2 uh, stereo amplifier, and it is compact size, you see, compared to my hand, what the size is. Also in the big box that it comes in, you get a complete wiring harness that uh, plugs up to everything on the bike. No, uh, no cutting wires, complete plug and play. The, uh, the other thing that I did in addition to the stereo upgrade was that I did, I ordered the uh, Dynamat control uh, system for the inside of my fairing. So this is what it looks like inside of the fairing and if you've never used Dynamat, Dynamat is a sound deadening, sound control and what it does on the motorcycle is that instead of so your speaker pods are in this area on the motorcycle. So instead of allowing any sound to come out, it'll deaden it and force all the sound back toward the rider. So it's a drastic improvement from what factory had. So as far as the motorcycle is concerned, everything on the motorcycle is completely factory. There's uh, no indication, no indication that we've done anything extra. Uh, I. On my, when I had it apart, I went ahead and put some of the LED accent lighting. I went ahead and put it in behind the speaker grills. Um, if you turn it off, it just looks like the factory speaker. The other thing that I did was inside of the kit, um, these little kicker logos, they were inside and they're made to mount on those uh, speaker rings that I told you that I didn't use um, because I used the factory speaker covers. So I just took them in and mounted them on there give it a little bit of a custom look. But as you can see, the amp, the amp is mounted directly below the in-dash and uh, there's no wiring. All of the wiring is completely hidden. It runs right along with all of the factory wires and uh, wouldn't even know that it's there. The, uh, the sound of the newly installed radio, um, I think if you installed this, sitting still it's loud it's um it's way loud but it's a little bit tinny and uh it kind of takes out a little bit of your bass response uh but for the most part if you're listening to it you're going to be listening to it at 75 or 70 or 60 mile an hour and at 60 mile an hour it sounds phenomenal it's crystal clear i can hear it i can make out the music i can make out the lyrics um you know, so so the the flop with not having the bass response while you're parked uh, is way outweighed by what you're getting at 75 miles an hour. The uh, uh, you know, think about it really. When are, when are you sitting around listening to your music in the parking lot? You know, not a whole lot. And if you want to do that, my suggestion is to add the speaker lids, uh, the speakers in the lids, and add that bigger speaker. This, uh, this kit, the wiring harness, there is already plugs there and uh, it's made to wire right into the rear speakers. So uh, in summary, the, uh, the Clockworks kit, the Clockworks uh, audio upgrade kit, thumbs up. I'd give you two thumbs up here, but I was holding the phone with one of them. Um, so, so two thumbs up, the other one's up there. It's, it's, it's up, trust me. But uh, well, 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 well worth the uh, money, well worth the install. And uh, my wife now can hear the radio when we're riding two up. Good, good Sam's! Good Sam's! Let's go! So the last thing that I want to add is when you add an amplifier to a motorcycle that previously did not have an amplifier, you're going to have to go get your, uh, your ECM flashed and your radio flashed in order to let the radio know that there's now an amplifier on the bike. So all, all secrets out here, I ain't going to hold anything back. When you add the amplifier, you're going to have to make arrangements 
to go get your radio flashed. And that might cost you extra money unless you got some connections in the business. So just keep that in mind that uh, flashing the ECM, that is something that's going to have to be done. Okay. So thank you guys uh, for watching. And uh, seriously, uh, if you want an affordable, easy install upgrade for your motorcycle, this is Street Glide, Road Glide. Um, I, I guess you can add this to anything that's got the speaker system, but it is all plug and play. I didn't cut one single wire on my motorcycle. And if I would have worked straight through, I could have had this complete install done in about three hours. So clockworks, this is the kicker audio upgrade and uh, uh, well worth it. Well worth it.